Homer Bailey, your impressions, a uh, second straight good one for me. Yeah, you know, I think this is, after having three surgeries on his arm, you know, you, you, you start to go, uh, how long is it going to take for him to round into form? Has he lost anything through, anything through the process? I think certainly the last two games would suggest that he is really getting back to uh, the homer that we knew before he started to have the, you know, the injury problems. Um, he felt great. He went back out there. I think he still had good stuff in the seventh. He just wasn't quite as sharp, and, uh, and it kind of created an opportunity for Lorenzo to come in and close the door. The pitching that you have received the last two days, and you had Romano getting his first major league victory earlier on in the week, has to give you a lot of encouragement going into the, coming out of the break. It does. It, it's you know we 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 know I think we all know universally that there's an area if we do better if we perform at a higher rate that all of a sudden we're I think we're still at one of the better teams in our division. I do, and it people laugh at me because we're at the bottom of the division, but we get that type of starting pitching on a consistent basis we every other area of our of our game is is solid we're really good offensive defensive and and, and relief pitching type club but we need uh, to enhance the quality of our starts to get deeper into the game not ask so much from the bullpen and we have the equipment here and now we just got to be somewhat patient with the young guys allow them to get their footing and homer to get back into the mix but things can only really get better if uh, if these young kids continue to grow. We bring just Di Scalfani back at some point in August, and all of a sudden, you know, every fifth day we're looking at a, a really nice pitcher, you know, giving us a chance to win a ball game. We've almost run out of things to talk about with Joey Votto, but another RBI today. He goes into the break with 68, but 26 home runs, league leading in the National League. Is that even surprising to you that that those power numbers? Yeah, it is. You know, I I think that you know I. I I think my first year was the year, uh, my first year with the Reds in 2010 was the year he won the MVP. I think he hit 37 homers, I believe, that year. And, uh, you know, to have 26 at the break um, is at, at 33, you know, uh, seven years removed from 2010 uh, is something I would not have ever guessed that would be a part. You know, he's just such a line drive hitter, gap to gap guy, on base guy. Um, I just could not have said that I would have expected. I think he has it, certainly has it in him, and he's showing that. But uh, I wouldn't have gone into the season saying this guy's going to have 26 to break.